Hello my friends, my name is Chaotic Singularity, and that was an amazing, epic, awesome thingamabob Russian accent that I can do. <laughs> I'm kidding. That was probably pretty bad, but... Uh, okay, well, let's get to the point here. Uh, this uh, new video, as you can see, and this one is... Well, first off, I want to say that I have purchased... Why well, I actually haven't purchased. I downloaded the trial version because I'm... I think I actually sold my Mac, and I'll be getting my PC very soon, and I'll be downloading Fraps to do some other things, like uh, record uh, new WoW things and stuff like that. But for now, I got this uh, this program called ScreenFlow, and it's really awesome. Like I've tested it out a little bit here and there, and I'm really liking it. There might be something flashing or something like that, so pay no attention to that, because I just want to... Uh, I kind of test it out and uh, see if you guys like it, because I'll be doing a little bit of Minecraft stuff with this type of uh, program until I get my PC. But the uh, main point of this video is I'm going to show you guys how to install texture packs in Minecraft and on the Mac and on the PC. It's very similar, so uh, I, you might be able to do it on the PC this way too. So I'm just going to show you guys how to do this. Okay, so you go to Google. And you want to Google texture packs for Minecraft. And this one here is it's called Minecraft Sandbox. And this is actually a really good, uh, there's quite a bit of uh, pretty sweet texture packs on here. I'm just going to show you the one that's pretty much most popular is the LB Photorealism texture pack. And before you do any of these HD texture packs, I really suggest you, well, you have to, uh, download this thing called MC Patcher Mod. So you just gotta click on that link, and it brings you to this uh, download here sign. There's also a video here too, if you don't know uh, how to add mods and stuff to the patcher, which is really easy. All you need to do when you get it up, you press the plus button, and you just kind of find your um, your file, your Minecraft texture pack file, and you just put it in. It's, it's really simple. So you just download it here, and I've already downloaded it, so this is it right here. You get kind of like a coffee mug, and you just click that, and here's the texture pack here, the MC Patcher mod. Okay, now after you have that downloaded, you go back and you'll get uh, five ver versions, one 16 by 16 resolution up to the 256 by 256. I can do the 256 by 256, but it's uh, it's pretty like if I spin around too quickly, it will affect like it gets kind of laggy. So I usually just stick with the 64 or the 128. And down here it shows you some uh, problems and some helps and stuff like that. Okay, so you just download anyone here. So let's just download the 64 times 64. And you get to this awesome ad, which kind of looks like this music type of thing. And you just skip the ad. And you come here to the download, you click download, it starts to download, and it comes up. And when it comes up, you, I'm not going to download because I already have it. And when you have it with the zip file, and if you don't know how to just get the zip file, you go to Safari, this is if you're using Safari, uh, then you go to preferences, and then it's right here. Open save files after downloading, you uncheck it because it needs to be in a zipped file for it to work. If it's not in the zipped file, then it, just, it won't work at all. So you want to uh, uncheck this, because it will be like this, and you want to uncheck it so it stays a zipped file and doesn't automatically open itself. So when you have that downloaded, you go to your... Boom, here we are. Oh, back over this. You go to... Sorry about that. I'm just uh, kind of sick here for the holidays, yippee. <laughs> and go to your uh, your name, and you go to application support. And when you find an application support, you will find a Minecraft folder right here. And you'll have your saves, blah, 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 your mods, and you'll have your texture packs right here. And all you do is, well, first thing, when you get your uh, your MC patcher, you want to enable HD textures and you patch it and then when you do that then you drag your zip file into the texture pack folder 
And when you do that, you uh, go back to MC Patcher, you patch it, and you play Minecraft. And when you have Minecraft, you will. I'll uh, show you it here. And I'm gonna sh and write and you go texture packs and then here it is default and the LB realism. I have the uh, time 64 right now, so I will be getting uh, be getting lots of Minecraft stuff out later in the future. But this is just a little video that will hopefully uh, help you guys out. And yeah, so make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, uh, rate, comment, and favorite. And subscribe and please uh, like my, like my video to crap because that helps out a lot and uh, just would be awesome. I like to see likes. <laughs> okay, thanks guys. Uh, thanks. Uh, peace out.